Welcome to this new video of the list dedicated to the programming of the Raspberry Pi in an easy way. You will find the link of the list in the description. In our last video, we saw how to send data to ThinkSpeak. In this video, we will see how to get data. One uh, of the things that you can do uh, later is to control your objects uh, from uh, any place. This is my channel. On field 1, the last value is 1. So the challenge here is to get uh, this data on your Raspberry Pi. Let's go to the site easycoding.tn and search for any link to EasyPython. This block will send a HTTP request to ThinkSpeak to ask for data. You will need uh, the read the key and uh, the channel ID. I will put the result of the request into a variable. After that, I will show uh, the answer. Now we can upload our program. This is the answer from ThinkSpeak. We call that a JSON format. It contains several data, but the one that uh, we need is field uh, 1. I will create a new variable. This block will load the data into the variable. After that, you need to know the JSON name that you want to display. In our case, uh, it is a field 1, but it could be also uh, one of the others. And uh, that's it. We are ready to try. And uh, here we are. Now I will make a new test by uploading new data.
Just change the last value here and execute the command. I sent here uh, 10 into field 1. And uh, here we are. I hope that you liked the video and see you soon. Bye.